Yeah. Now I'll be giving you some questions. Uh, uh, there are three of them. Yata. So please um, answer the following. First, sanggang dikit. The boxes are both moving to the right at off on a rough surface. Again, this is I'm uh, sorry. This is a rough surface. So, rough surface siya. Draw the free body diagram. So again, you have two boxes A and B. A 100 newton force acts on A. Uh, what are the what is the free body diagram for box A? Siya? Okay, okay. Drawing na, na drawing. Okay. Now let's go to B. Lonesome lemon. A lemon is placed on top of a flat table. Which of the following forces comprise an action reaction pair? Ito na yung sinasabi kong mga tanong. Lumalabas sa exam. A. The weight of the lemon and the normal force on the lemon. B. The weight of the lemon and the weight of the table. C. The weight of the lemon and the force of the lemon on earth. Or D. The force on, of the table on the lemon and the normal force on the lemon. Again, we have a lemon that is placed on top of a flat table. Which of the following forces comprise an action-reaction pair? A, the weight of the lemon and the normal force on the lemon. B, the weight of the lemon and the weight of the table. C, the weight of the lemon and the force of the lemon on earth. Or D, the force of the table on the lemon and the normal force on the lemon. Okay. Okay. Now, for the third item, sliding block. A block is fired up from a rough ramp with an inclined angle of 35 degrees. Which free body diagram properly represents the forces acting on the block? Again, this also, I think, uh, uh, exam question to, the, to before. So A, is it this diagram here? Is this this diagram here, letter B? Is this this diagram here, letter C? Or is this diagram here, letter C? Back a check. Again. So yeah, let's have we have two minutes to answer this. So so, so yeah. So for the first question, what is the free body diagram of box A? So what are the forces acting on box A here in this particular item? What are the forces acting on box A? Yeah. Anima forces sayon. Anima forces sayon. Of course, you have your normal force, your weight, and this force here. Some applied force 100 newtons. So let's say it's FA. Some applied force. So when we draw our free body diagram, let me remove this. So we have a dot. And what are the forces? Again, we have our weight. Um, some will write this as W vector. Para lang madali. And then we have an applied force. Uh, uh, note here na outward ang ginamit ko. Pwede kasing paloob yan, pero weird isulat yon. It's always outward pag free body diagram. So F equals 100 newtons. And the normal force and vector, uh, so this is some FA vector, which is the normal force is upward, the FA is to the left. Wait, to the right, sorry. To the right. Questions? Nakuha? Nakuha to? Nakuha to? Yes, sir. Okay, I hope you get this. And then second, I, um, then of course, you have frictional force. Bakit? Kasi rough surface siya. The, and Ganito, bakit sa kabila? Bakit hindi na sa kabila? Because again, the tendency of this 100 newtons force is to, to push box A. And to push box A, what will what will be the motion of box A? What is the tendency of the of the box A's motion? Papuntang right. Tama? Since papunta siyang right, therefore the direction of the frictional force, since it, it opposes the tendency of the ob object's motion, the direction of the frictional force is to the left. Tama? That's why the frictional force here is to the left. So, questions? So, may tanong? May tanong ba? Answer. Answer. Ah, okay. Now let's go to... Uh, also, there's another force. <laughs> Nakakalimutan natin force. Eh, no? Also, since connected yung A at B, box B will act on box A. At the same time, box A will act on box B. Diba? By Newton's third law, ang importante lang sa atin kung paano nag act yung box B kay box A. Therefore, you have a force exerted by B on A. B there is external in a sense. Okay, again, we're only interested in the forces acting on, on A, not on B. Nakuha? Nakuha to? Questions? So the, all the forces are, you have the normal force, you have your weight, um, applied force of 100 Newtons, Frictional force and the force exerted by B on A. Questions? May tanong? Yan. May limang forces dyan. <laughs> Medyo marami. Okay, now, for the second question, ano yung sagot? 
So letter A, tama ba yung letter A? The weight of the lemon and the normal force on the lemon? Action-reaction clear ba yan? Note, para silang nag kay lemon, no? Therefore, ano siya? Hindi na yan yung sagot. Kasi they both act on the same object. Again, action-reaction pairs will never act on the same object. Okay, so A is wrong. Mali na yung wrong, mali na yung A. Letter B, the weight of the lemon and the weight of the table. Oh, well, it makes sense. Oh, hindi naman nag-act sa same object eh. But they are, they are, acted, uh, isa lang yung nag-act sa kanila. Ano ulit yung nag-act sa both lemon and table in this context? Ano yan? Yung weight ito, ang nag-act sa kanila ay earth. Earth will act on the lemon, earth will also act on the table. Pero, does it form an action-reaction pair? Hindi naman opposite forces yan. Parang yung downward, kasi weight yan eh. Hence, again, letter B is wrong. What about letters? Uh, what about letter um, um, letter D? The force of the table on the lemon and the normal force on the lemon. Force of the table on the lemon, normal force on the lemon. Ano yan? Di ba parehas lang yan? <laughs> they're the same, they pertain to the same force. The force, the normal force exerted by the table on the lemon is the normal, is the force exerted by the table on the lemon. Diba? So D is also not correct. Hence, the answer is letter C. Again, for letter C, the weight of the lemon here means force exerted by earth on the lemon. And the force exerted, therefore, the reaction force is you just interchange the earth and the lemon here. Interchange yung dalawang yan. You get the reaction force, which is the force exerted by the lemon on the earth. Okay? Nakuha? Nakuha to? Nakuha? Yes. And then, finally, we have letter C. A sliding block. A block is fired up from a rock in ramp. Which of the following is the correct free body diagram? Okay. The direction of motion or the expected the um, tendency of the object's motion is upward. Therefore, uh, okay. So, ano dito yung obvious na mali? Letter C is obviously wrong. Why? Again, the rule, golden rule here is MA shouldn't be part of the free body diagram. Now, okay. What about letter D? Is letter D correct? Is letter D correct? Okay, tama naman yung friction, no? Friction is downward. Okay, so mali na rin tong letter A kasi the direction of motion, friction is upward here, but again, you, friction should oppose the tendency of an object's motion. Okay, so the force, the frictional force here, pero ano yung, ano yung direction? Wait, tama naman, downward. Wait, is always downward. Pero what about normal force? So, what about normal force? So, Ano yung direction ng normal force? So, upward ba dapat ang direction ng normal force dyan? No, di ba? Hindi. Kasi the, the, the incline here is in this direction. This is the surface. Hence, dapat ang normal force ay perpendicular lagi sa surface. And therefore, the answer is letter B. Tama? Gets? Gets? Nakuha? Question. Okay.